Meta was established in 1973. When Meta was created, the mission was thought of as not having enough investment. So Meta was created to bring in businesses, strengthen businesses, and create more businesses in this neighborhood. Meta serves over 7,000 community members each year, and over 75% of them identify as Latino, but there's huge diversity within that. So some of us are immigrants, some of us are children of immigrants, um, some of us are from Mexico, some are from Central America. And that's why we've really evolved our work here at Meta, so that it's not just focused on a service or on a program, but that we have a holistic approach to supporting the strengths of our community. Mi nombre es Luz Rodríguez y vivo aquí en el área de la misión. Yo soy de México y llegué aquí hace en el 2004. Mi experiencia trabajando con Meda y con el equipo de aquí de, de Meda ha sido, pues, estoy muy afortunada. Mi experiencia al ir al Capitolio en Sacramento, wow, fue una experiencia maravillosa porque pues nunca me imaginé yo llegar a, hasta allá, ¿verdad? El pisar, el conocer a estas personas que nos pueden ayudar, que nos pueden... Si no tenemos ese apoyo, pues prácticamente no, no tendríamos mayores oportunidades, así que fue una experiencia increíble. Y trabajar para la comunidad, wow, es genial. Med is often asked how we've been able to develop such a robust ecosystem approach to economic development. And the fact of the matter is that we had no choice. Being in San Francisco, a lot of the economic pressures that our communities were facing were really rapidly escalating. And other communities have actually been turning to us as well and asking us to respond. By Meda, creating opportunities and spaces for organizations like Building Sales Partnership to come together with other organizations it helps us share our power. We want to see families that feel like they have the agency to make educated decisions for their own betterment and for the betterment of their community and ultimately building wealth. It's really important that we share those same resources and that we share that capacity across the country so that other communities can benefit and hopefully avoid some of the same challenges that we've had to deal with here locally. A real call to action was when we realized that 8,000 people had been displaced from the neighborhood. That's about a third of our population. And so based on that, we understood that while Meta and our community partners were providing very strong services, services were not enough to address the problem of displacement and gentrification. So Meta became an affordable housing developer about five years ago. Since then, we have about 1,200 units in the pipeline. Uh, we have five new construction projects and we bought 23 apartment buildings. We think that services are great, should be supported, should be strengthened, but now we're actively building housing for our tenants, we're creating spaces for our small businesses, and then we're housing our community partners. We've really had no choice but to respond really aggressively with an ecosystem approach to economic development. What we want to do is share this with other organizations and other communities to see if we can delay the same pressures that are happening locally for them and actually reverse the displacement and gentrification of our communities.